So I run into this video about this girl complaining about not getting proposed to. And I'm like, I know the comment's about to be good. This person says that's three years too many. This blob thing says just leave. It works every time. This girl says she waited 10. Damn, she waited 15 years. It seems like people are unsure how long you should wait before you get married or propose to somebody. Now where this gets good is she decides to make a reaction video with said guy. We're at a little Sonic date. This is Derek, everybody. The boyfriend that I've been dating for six years and he still hasn't proposed. Anyways, Derek. And if my mouth is red, I'm drinking a red slushie. Um, but Derek, why haven't you proposed to me yet? Bro's like, holy fuck, you're really doing this on TikTok. He just doesn't look happy to be there at all. Just haven't gotten around to it yet. <laughs> she's laughing way too hard. I think it's because she's like, see guys, this is what he tells me. Do you have plans to, pr to propose to me? Yeah, one day, hopefully. Can we, can we be a little serious? Come on, you're not hangry anymore. You just ate. He's trying to quit chewing, so he's been a little on edge lately because <laughs> he's trying to give up tobacco and nicotine. So I'll give him a little break. <laughs> How is it going to be a surprise if you keep asking me about it every day? Stop <laughs> asking about it and it will happen. It, okay, I, I'll try my best to stop asking about it. I'm just really Don't excited for best. it to happen. Just stop asking about it. Just do better, Natalie. Do better. I ain't gonna cap. He don't look like he want to get married, bro. And she's over here laughing, but I think that's like a defense mechanism to like her sadness. Because I think this actually hurts her. I think she's actually sad about this and she's just responding with laughter. It just feels off. Okay, but really quick. Tell everyone why you already feel married to me. <laughs> I feel this way too. I feel this way too. Stop the cap. <laughs> If you really feel like you were married, you wouldn't have been bugging this man. We share a bank account. We're on the same phone plan. Have a house together. Own companies together. Multiple businesses. What more do you want from me? Wait, and for those of you who don't know me, I race professionally in NASCAR. And we met racing, like short track racing locally. And he quit racing to come help me find sponsorship so I can pursue my dream. Like, that's better than a ring. Plus, but I still want the ring. Plus, the dogs are in my name, so I know she ain't going nowhere. All right, we're Everything out his mouth is a red flag. Let me go see these comments. Everybody is on here warning her, saying, bro, he don't want to do it. All of these got 10K likes. Girl, you got all of TikTok. His tone is a red flag. <laughs> this is going to be a messy breakup. This person says, I don't think this was the video that you wanted it to be. I don't think so either. Which is crazy because she saw these comments and she made one more video. So many of you hate my boyfriend right now and it hurts my heart because you don't know him at all. And he's seriously the best person in this whole freaking <laughs> Bro was like, oh my God, TikTok is on to me. Heart because you don't know him at all. And he's seriously the best person in this whole freaking world. He's my best friend, my only friend, but you're my best friend. And my lover. I will be better at not trying to be joking all the time and especially about serious stuff like this. Yeah, he was totally joking in the in the video of us talk when I asked him if he's ever gonna propose to me. And you guys just don't know him and don't know how I he am jokes gonna around. Propose to this girl. You are my one and only. I was gonna say, look at we're responding to he just is waiting to meet the right one. So that's what we're responding to. I met the right one. I knew since day one. And I will propose to you. When you first saw me when I was fourteen and you were eighteen, is that when you knew? What? What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. We didn't start dating until I was eighteen, okay? <laughs> Bro is over here like, if you tell them one more thing, what else you want to tell them? What else you want to tell them? We are such, we are such a great team. We work together. We're with each other 24-7. We love each other so much. We work hard together. And... Who are you trying to prove this to? And I was the one that said two years ago when marriage got brought up, when we first like really moved in together, maybe that was four years ago, it got brought up. And I told him two years and that two year mark was coming up. And I said, two more years. And why I said that, and we're on that year now. So like it better happen this year. <laughs> why I said that is because I was really focusing on my career. 
or like i don't i hate seeing my career because like even though i'm the one racing in nascar right now it's like our career you know what i mean like we're a team yeah the checks get written out to natalie decker Bro's, like, entire body language is just sus. It's like someone's in the back of the car with a gun on his head or something. Every time she's like, right, we do this, right? He's just like... But you still get to spend the money. I'm his sugar mama. <laughs> just kidding, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. He finds the big money. NASCAR is expensive, and he finds the big money, I'm but then we have to spend it right away. <laughs> I like that. That should be your title in your Instagram bio. You might have to change it. So is the ring going to come this year? The ring will come. Do you get annoyed when I ask you about it? Slightly. <laughs> but he gets... Only because... Yeah, he told me why. You were the one that kept telling me to wait. Like, I've been... Ready since day one. <laughs> I had the ring bought at one point, and then I had to pay for some of the NASCAR stuff. It's a long story. <gasps> Do you want to hear the, sto the ring story? He did have my ring. But then we were short money on a NASCAR race, and he had to sell the ring. He sold y'all a wedding ring for a NASCAR race? Uh, I don't know about that, bro. That's a good excuse. It's so funny because she'd be like, come on, tell him. Tell TikTok what you told me. And then she just starts laughing, but it's not funny. These red flags is not funny. Do you want to hear that story? Short of she deserves a ring on, is it this finger? Yeah, it's this finger. On this finger. You've been waiting to get married since day one, but you are unsure which finger to put it on? This whole thing just feels so satire, but it's not. This finger? On this finger, we've never been in a rush to get married because signing a piece of paper isn't going to change our relationship. Very Short true. of, she wants to show off some days a very glamorous ring and some days just a simple gold band. You know me so well. <laughs> ah, y'all, I'm off this. What y'all think about this? By the way, I want to say energy, bro. We just hit 300k followers, bro. So on Dan and them, if y'all like this shit, can you follow the page? I'm really a music artist, bro, but I make these videos for y'all because I know y'all like them. So please just like these videos.